What is up, guys? It's Super Ken from Super Ken Gaming from the channel. Please subscribe, leave a comment saying hi, thumbs up if you like the video already. Share this video with your friends. And welcome to my second ever unboxing, but my first ever unboxing of a loot crate kind of thing. But it's it is loot. It's from Loot Crate, but it's not Loot Crate because I'm not a hashtag dork. But what I am is a nerd. So instead of Loot Crate, we got ourselves some loot gaming and. Again, this is only my second ever unboxing. My first unboxing was of a press kit for Layers of Fear. And I did take some feedback from you guys from that unboxing video. People were saying they actually want to see me open the open on screen instead of like show you, take it off, and then show you items. You guys want to actually see it all. So I'm going to try my hardest to let you guys actually see it all. Turn this into slash and ASMR video and I'm, I'm not sure what's in the box at all I, I'm I think maybe I hopefully and I got in time for the November loot crate because I'm much more interested in the franchises that were featured in the November loot crate which is I think Dragon Age and Assassin's Creed and I'm not sure what else but this month's loot crate or loot gaming if you I'm guess I'm guessing space. December's theme is space, so if your thing's loot crate or loot gaming, you'll get space. But loot gaming's franchise for the month of December is Mass Effect, Destiny, Ratchet and Clank, and XCOM 2. Really, the the only franchises I'm interested in those four are Ratchet and Clank. So I'm I'm kind of hoping that this loot loot gaming box is not December's, and this is actually November's loot gaming. But I'm going to open up and find out. I'll probably leave a link in the description. Maybe maybe some discount of some sort. So click that link in the description if you're interested in some loot gaming, gaming or loot crate. So let's get started. Let, let you guys have the first, the first look. Maybe. Let's see how we open this. Maybe... maybe Move my microphone this way. Here it is. The beauty of loot gaming. P please leave me feedback on how to make unboxings better. Because I'm new to this. And looks like we got good old November, which makes me happy. Right off the bat, we see some Dragon Age and some Okami. So let's grab the shirt first. Let's check out the shirt. Then we get back to that box by the way I, I, I scratch your the white stuff you're seeing at the bottom is my address scratched out or ripped out the first shirt we got is some Assassin's Creed heck yes and and it's long sleeve I I, I was afraid they're gonna send me some short sleeve nonsense like they don't realize that it's freaking December up here in Ohio we got we got a nice Assassin's Creed, and for those for, for those of you that don't know, Assassin's Creed is my favorite series. So I'm super excited about this, and I'm even more so excited that this this is a, a navy a navy blue and a black shirt. So I can actually I can actually wear wear this on gameplay videos. Not many people point it out, but I, I do wear the the same shirts a lot in my videos because I'm working with this bad boy, a green screen. Colors are super annoying to work with. So black black and dark blue, white, those are those are the ideal deal colors to work with with the green screen. So th this has me excited that Assassin's Creed. Though my arms are super long. So I don't I don't know if this is gonna fit my arms. Maybe no knowing this is a long sleeve, maybe I should have ordered a size up. I don't know. I'll have to try it on and find out but either way I could just roll up the sleeves and wear it that way like a hashtag hipster the the yellow may, may give me some trouble the yellow may give me some trouble for the green screen but you won't see much of the yellow anyway very excited for this shirt it, it, it's pretty it's a pretty thin shirt I'm not sure how warm it'll how warm it'll keep me but it's of decent quality not not super thick like I would hope for or wish made of cotton and polyester so decent quality tip typical shirt look forward to wearing some of that and next up on our list i'm gonna grab this 
Dragon Age. The Heroes of Thetis. Exclusive Sacred Ashes Morgan. Oh, this is Morgan from um Dragon Age 1. Is this is this the different Well, we're going to open her up. 3-inch blind boxes. So, I'm not sh There's there's all the little the Dragon Age characters you get. We got Flemeth, don't know who they are. Flemeth Dragon. Veneris, Isabella, Grey Warden. I was the Grey Warden, right? That was the whole thing. Andres, Arshok, Lelena, Morgan, Alistar, Varric, and Mabari Warhound. I, th I think uh, Mor Morgan's the one we made sweet love to at the end of Dragon Age Origins. Dragon Age Origins is the only one I played. I used to date a girl that was obsessed with Dragon Age. So this is this is kind of this this box is kind of a mix of my life. Assassin's Creed and Dragon Age. All right. Almost forgot. O open it in front of you guys. I got this nice black thing. This little this black bag. But I, I think maybe everybody gets this exclusive, but we'll we'll find out and see. Let's open this up. Turn this into ASMR. Here we go, guys. Listen. Ooh, yeah, that nice pool. And inside, we got her. We got our good old Morgan. Just as I was hoping. Exclusive Sacred Ashes Morgan. So, I'm guessing the Sacred Ashes one is green, so this is just regular Morgan, right? It looks like that. It looks like it. Is this? Does this tell you? It's not really a blind bag if it tells you, right? Or is this? No, the, the sacred ashes one. No, this. I think this is the sacred ashes. I don't know. If you guys, if you guys know what the sacred ashes even means, let me know. It's also inside. We've got some blue blue flames. Some waka flock of flames inside of here. Let's try to open this up. This so we don't really need to lift it up. open. It's kind of already open. Got some blue flames of love. I was a f I was a fan of Morgan, and I and I'm actually excited. I know who it is, and she's actually from the original, the original Dragon Age. You can put her little flame in there. Nice little figure for the Dragon Age fans and. Surprisingly, somebody I actually know and care about from the game. So super excited about that because I'm not, I'm not a huge Dragon Age dork, but get, getting that figure I do actually care about and know is nice. I hopefully I'll be playing Dragon Age two. Maybe she shows up again with my baby inside of her. Because we we definitely made some babies. And next up in the loot gaming box, we got the good old Capcom Okami. Okami Den. What is this? A loot crate exclusive, guys. So if you guys want some awesome exclusives like this, which, by the way, this box is beautiful. A beautiful looking box. You can only get this stuff from loot crate if you're a dork. You can get loot gaming if you're a nerd like me and not a dork with a loot crate. That loot crate pop culture nonsense. We're not dorks over here. We're nerds. So let's open this up. Hopefully not damage the box because we're not Greg Miller. Nice open. I've actually never played Okami, though I do. I own Okami HD. Maybe, maybe I'll get to it this year. Maybe I'll get to it another year. But I do want to play it one day. Wow, that that's really nice. An Okami figure inside. That's awesome. The nice, the nice details. The nice, the nice fire thing on her back. The nice dog butthole. <laughs> what? I I turned that over as a joke and there's an X under there. So this nice X dog butthole. The the little paw prints, that's some pretty nice detail. I I really like this figure. I I've I've seen unboxings in the past, and th this is by far the best the best loot crater loot gaming box I've ever seen. 
Okami. Some Dragon Age nerd stuff. And we got ourselves an Assassin's Creed shirt. Hello, this is like a 10 out of 10 box already. But we've, we've got we've got a couple more items in here. The, the party's not over yet, you guys. Because next up... Ooh, I'll save that for last. Looks like a poster of some sort. This, this, ni this nice... Mystic. Wait, Team Mystic. Hashtag Team Mystic. Oh, Mythic. Mythic. It's a Mythic box. That makes sense. It's a nerd box, guys. With the, with the s little scratches. I'm not sure what those scratches are from. Are those Witcher, Witcher 3 scratches? Or are they, like, Evolve? So we got some Harry, Harry Potter Mythic nonsense. Maybe, maybe, maybe that's what it was all for. For that new Harry Potter nonsense that came out but we got we got a nice mythic pin and hashtag team mystic on pokemon go got that zapdos life fabula sunt verum november 2016 mythic this is actually a nice looking metal pin let's open this beauty up the asmr style a very nice pin guys it's metal uh, is it metal the I don't know if you guys can hear that but it's metal a, ni a nice shiny coin looking thing but of course it's a pin it's a nice pin a nice a nice metal pin I, I wasn't expecting pin quality be to be that high but also in this box, besides the poster, this is the final, the final item. Looks like Castlevania. I've never played Castlevania one or two, though I do have them. Maybe again we'll get two of them this year. Let's open it up inside. What is this exactly? Konami Digital Entertainment. This product is manufactured under the license of Konami Digital Entertainment, exclusive to Loot Gaming. So this is a Loot Gaming exclusive. Like this, and I think this is actually an exclusive. I, I don't know. Again, I don't know what the Sacred Ashes nonsense is about. But let's open this up, see what's inside. Don't fall. Don't fall. Ooh, what is that? A sword of some sort. We got a, a dorky a dorky sword. What is it? Is it just a sword? Well, nerds, it's your lucky day. You get a this is metal. This is metal, probably made of the same metal around, I, I don't know. I don't think this is steel. Maybe, maybe it is. I, I don't know. My metal's all too well. This is metal. Get a nice look on the details. A pretty detailed sword, though it's not sharp. Actually, I don't know. I may use this as a butter knife. <laughs> this is my new go-to knife. I I don't I don't really I don't really know what this what this is. If you guys know what this is, let me know. Maybe the poster kind of tells you, but I don't know. It's some dorky Castlevania stuff. So if you're in Castlevania, you got yourself a sword. Again, I haven't played Castlevania to know if I'm into it. I haven't even played the old ones, the old brutal ones. Sorry, Colin Mori Moriarty. Hashtag sorry. We got a nice s dorky sword with a dorky sword case very pleased with the quality of this week's box and the final item Ooh, hello is this my overwatch girlfriend the angel girl i've got a poster of some sort let's open it up who is this what a hashtag babe She's riding some sort of griffin. Can we get the whole picture? All right, that, that's about the that's about as good as I'm gonna get showing showing the picture. But let me actually get a look at this. The color is the color is really nice. This is a, a very. 
beautiful painting style. Got that loot gaming. I don't know who this is. If you guys know who this is, if you guys know who this dorky girl is, let me know. She's kind of hot. She's she kind of looks like that. She's kind of got that crazy girlfriend look in her eye. So I don't know. Here on the back, we got some explaining. We got we got some explaining to do of these items. So I'm I'm gonna read these off. On my good old loot crate gaming map. We got Dragon Age Origins Sacred Ashes Mor Morgan figure. So there's there's our answer. Features Morgan's outfit from Dragon Age Origins Sacred Ashes trailer. All right, I've never seen that trailer, but explains a lot. We got that mythic coin pin, which is nice, nice quality. We got Okami, Okami Den figure. The protagonist of Okami sequel Okami Den. Oh, so that's not from Okami. That's from a different game. All right. It's a letter opener. That, that's what that dorky Castlevania thing. It's a Castlevania letter opener. I just open letters with my hands like a man, cause I'm a man. We don't we don't melt wax anymore. But but thank thanks for the thought. All right. If somebody ever sells me a, sends me a letter melted with wax and stand, I'll definitely grab my new Castlevania butter knife. Thanks, dorks. <laughs> and finally, we have Assassin's Creed Jack Daw Cresty. Oh the. Edward from Edward Kenway's pirate boat. It's a joke. It's an Assassin's Creed joke. Don't call it a boat. But the I, I didn't even notice the jackdaw, the jackdaw crusty. How how was that the jackdaw? I, I don't I don't get it. My jackdaw was a, I think my jackdaw was a hashtag babe on the front because you, you could customize it. So I'm not sure if you could like throw that eagle that eagle on there. I think that's an eagle. Known for fly high flying adventure and sneaky assassinations, the Assassin's Creed series spans video games. Yeah, we know. Thanks. Thanks. And the Eris Racing Drone Epic Drop. For those people that want to be Casey nice nice that. Five lucky winners get the Eris Racing Drone Epic Drop. Well it looks like I was not one of those five lucky winners. Thank you guys. By the way, again, loot gaming. I don't know if I mentioned this in the beginning. Loot Crate Loot Gaming, they sent me this. I didn't pay for it. They sent it to me. But if I had paid for it, I would not be disappointed. We got a, we got a nice nice ten dollar T shirt. Got a nice ten dollar figure. A nice seven dollar figure. So that's what twenty seven dollars. And we got this nice butter knife, which I I would say this this final butter knife pushes it over the edge of the $30 price so was this crate was this box with the price yes this is probably the first loot loot crate gaming or loot crate box I've ever seen that was worth the price so I haven't seen all too many I, I've seen a bunch of unboxes before but I've always been uh, about them but this one this was a pretty this was a pretty decent box but thank you guys so much for watching let me let me know what you th what you thought of the box. Do you think that was worth the around thirty dollars it costs? Unless I get some discount down in the description. Hopefully, I'm gonna put some link down there. Maybe it'll give you some money off. Maybe it won't. You'll have to click and see. But thank you guys for watching. Give me some feedback. How can I make my unboxings better? Thanks for watching. Of course, stay beautiful.